was not planning on filming, but I'm really in the mood to film. And um, I'm like getting ready, not necessarily getting ready to go to bed, bed but like starting my process, like my daily process. Uh, so I have like a nose patch on right now and I need to shave my face. So I was gonna do that really quick, but I'm breaking out so bad. Like it's mainly all on my neck. I've never gotten acne on my neck before. Don't know why. Like right now, like this one is popped and it hurts so bad. But like, I don't know why all of a sudden, like I don't feel like I've been doing anything differently. Oops. <laughs> Something bad just happened, I guarantee, because people who are normally not active in my group chat are active right now, so that means that the series is going down. Holy shit. <laughs> just as when I'm like bored, I have nothing to do. That's crazy. Anyway, um, yeah, I noticed it while I was going to the bathroom at work. It's like looking at myself in the mirror. I don't know if that's gross, and that's like my hair. I was like, wow, I need to shave. So, because like it was like all oh, here. I was like, I just, I, you know, as much as I love having facial hair and it makes me feel good, I don't want to have like a deck of beard. I'm sorry if you can hear my boyfriend. And tell him I was going to be filming, so it's not like he's just trying to be quiet. Um, I don't have.
my, seriously, after shaving, I just feel like so much better already. I want to take this off, but I won't until it gets, like, crusty. But, like, I've already, I've had it on for, like, five minutes before I start filming. And that's another thing. I get, like, antsy with, like, skincare and stuff. So, like, I don't know. lady that answered she was so fucking nice to me so understanding so sweet love you and so she's like breaking my expenses down and we're talking and i felt super dumb because like i was nervous and i was anxious and i'm gonna take this off it's bothering me ow So he left the refrigerator door open and of course 
this on the day that it is fucking 86 degrees, right? So I get up in the morning. It's my day off. And you work, so you left. And it's been like almost six whole hours since you like left for work. I'm getting up. myself a shitty coffee and I'm gonna lay back down because it's like my day off you know what I'm saying like I don't do much on this video sorry about that and I'm, I get onto my kitchen because like our apartment is carpet except for the bathroom and then like there's like that kitchenette area and it's like vital and I get on there and tell me why it's soaked there's water everywhere I'm like what the he spilled water and didn't clean up. Maybe he's in a rush. You know, I didn't check my phone yet. So maybe he said something and, you know, I just hadn't seen it. So I was like, okay, like that kind of pisses me off, but whatever. Sorry, I'm like burping. I'm gonna put some uh, squally on. And um, I go out there and the fridge is cracked open and water is just pouring. Are you fucking me? Like, are you fucking kidding me? So I dump mostly everything out of the fridge. And like, because like I could smell like my spinach that I had in there. And I was just thinking maybe like he, he took it out to get something, you know, that he wanted for work and then forgot to put it in there, which like sucks. But like, you know, I wouldn't have been that bad. I had to throw away and we just got groceries. because I genuinely like I'm gonna be so fucking for real y'all there's so much preservatives in that in those bitches like I'm sure it's fine you know and but I threw most of the stuff that we had and I also eat like a lot of non-dairy food so some of that stuff is okay to be like not refrigerated like I made sure so like any of the stuff that I kept like I knew it was still safe to eat or like that was it or I doused it he however my father him was like don't throw my stuff I'll eat it still and I swear to God, he's been fine. But I took a bite of something he made at the fridge. I'm shitting for fucking days, bro. I don't care if that's TMI, bro. I, yesterday at work, I thought I was going to get my ass to be like, I was going to get in so much trouble. Because I was literally on the floor for maybe a whole hour out of my six hour shift. I was just in the bathroom, losing, struggling, losing, losing my life. That was rough. <laughs> so gross, but so true. And then what really pissed me off is like, so we don't have money. Like I've been going overdraft every single day this week, every single day, day, day. because like I just had shit like automatically coming out and I didn't realize. This is the Neutrogena Hydro Boost. So like first it was like. So I was like, fuck. And so I took money out of my savings to get me out of the negatives. So I had a good solid 34 cents in my checking account. Like, and I know how privileged it is to say I even have savings because I know, I know, trust me, I know. Um, savings is not there anymore. But I understand that even having a little bit is more than a lot of people have. Trust um, And so then I wake up the next morning another email from my bank Spotify took my last 34 fucking cents you bitches so I had to get more of my savings and put it in there and then so we're eating like all of our um what am I looking for like freezer food because I know that's for sure safe to eat and we bought like a couple first pieces thank god and <laughs> street not even a five minute drive we were not gone for 10 minutes this bitch is burnt to a fucking crisp it's a crispy crispy burnt and my mom like laughed at me and she sent me money love you mommy but like 
So trust this food stance is gonna be so helpful, even if it's not like a crazy amount, which I, I'm not expecting it to be. But um, it's like a relief. It's a relief. So I'm excited for that, and that's like very good news. Um, so yeah, that happened, and I was a little fucking rough. What else do I want to do? I don't know that I have any more like facial skincare other than like pimple patches, which I rolled out on. Oh my god, I'm gonna okay, it's not. I'm gonna take my shirt off now.
I've been kind of emotional recently. I think I'm about to start like, a, or I'm supposed to be on a menstrual cycle right now because I've been like cramping really bad and I've also just been getting like pretty, I would say like upset or like relatively like, not, I don't want to say no reason because I think There's a situation that was bothering me, so I brought it up to my boyfriend because I just wanted to like communicate it. And like, it's like involving people that he's close with, so obviously, like, he was gonna want to defend them and me or she me or me or her, you know. Um, which, like, I was expecting to not get me wrong, um, but like, we we're just like talking about it, and it was just like kind of an uncomfortable conversation because. If you keep up with it every day, you really won't see much unless you're like particularly pretty sweaty or something. But you should be good. But like, if you're like me and you forget, or you're just lazy as fuck, um, and you like wait a few days or something, I should oil this up. I don't have oil though. I'm just gonna pop them in. They should be. They should go. my teeth but I'm not gonna do that on camera so the last thing I would do is my medication and I also put like Vaseline all over my face but I'm not gonna do that until like I go right to bed so the first thing I take is these vegan collagen boosts I love these bitches they smell so good they smell like um, peppermint
makes sense to take it at night rather than be extra groggy in the morning. And then this is my testosterone gel. I just take two pumps. expensive <laughs> and it only came with this amount and like you know this filled out so um i'm gonna be here out of you i wasn't not impressed by that at all so i'm gonna be putting these on like all my fucking huge sits that's gonna pop in the middle of the night like most of these are gonna pop this video.